In this module, we'd like to explore some of the basic transitions and operation of the XVS switcher. Let's start with a basic mix operation. Preset where I want to go, and I can easily do a mix. Wipes. Let's double punch the wipe button so I can actually see what wipes I want to choose. I'm going to choose the number nine diagonal wipe, and you'll see I actually have a very nice soft border on there too. In order to adjust that border, I can go to the edge direction menu and go to soft border. You can see I can get, adjust the width, the inner and the outer softness of that border. Also notice that I right now have a mat filled in that border and it happens to be black. Anytime on the XVS switcher that I want to, I have luminance saturation in hue, I can touch one of those buttons and I get a color palette. So now I can easily change to a variety of colors that I've stored or use the preset colors that are there. I just changed it to red. And now you'll see if I come off and do some basic wipe transitions, I have a nice red border in there. Another feature of the XVS is that I can actually choose to fill that mat with the utility two bus. Every ME has a utility one and utility two bus. I hold down on my cross point pad utility button this becomes the utility one bus, this becomes the utility two bus. I can choose frame memory eight in utility two, and now I'm filled that white border with my XVS logo. And I have a nice basic transition. Now that we've created our simple wipe transition, we can actually store it into what the XVS calls wipe snapshots. Each ME has 10 wipe snapshots that can be stored. I do that on my flexi pad. I go to the white mode, I can hold down the white button, and store that wipe in the number three. I now can execute one wipe, recall a second wipe, and execute that, just like that, and go back to my other wipe. 